Hey YouTube, it's Jess. I am back today with another Bulk.com unboxing. Um, you guys wanted to see it, so here it is. It may not be the most exciting thing ever, but I guess if it's something that you're looking at doing um, and considering trying to make a little bit of extra income, uh, you know, these things are beneficial and educational. Um, I actually wrote the stats on the box today so I could just read it to you instead of always not remembering and listing it in the description below. So the retail value of this box is $581, which is um, less than the last one that I had. Um, the box cost me $82 plus $30 shipping, which makes for a total of $112. There are 61 items in this box and um, that equals out to a dollar and eighty four cents yep dollar and eighty four cents per item um, right now I'm kind of in the early stages of trying to figure this thing out a little bit um, this is the third box that I've purchased I do believe that it can be a good moneymaker on this side um, it would be a lot of work to try to do this just like nothing but this full-time and I'm sure there are some people that do that's great um, I don't have a lot of money to invest in something like that. Some of the boxes you see on there are thousands of dollars, but the payoff is, you know, five times that. So I've been getting boxes that range about $100 to $150 um, just because it's like, you know, I don't know. It's like anything. It's like gambling, you know what I mean? I don't have that much to gamble with, so my return won't be as much. But... I've been checking. This is going to be bad. I don't know where my um, box cutter is. <laughs> okay, that is the last time I'll use scissors to unbox one of these. I'll have to find my um, box cutter next time. You can't always get full retail for this stuff. Most of the time you're not going to get retail, like full retail for this stuff. And um, what I've been doing is scanning not all the manifests that come in. Obviously, I've, they'll pop up and I always just look at my price range. I'm not going to waste my time looking at stuff that's like $600. Eventually, maybe, yes, that would be um, a wise way to shop for this stuff, but um, I'm only looking at cases. I don't want to spend $200 on shipping. Um, it seems to me that usually, I don't know, probably different people do this different ways, but what I do is I look to see, are there a few items that will cover my cost for the whole box? If I can find a box or a case that has a few items that will cover all of my costs for sure, then the rest is just all profit. I think that's a smart way to do this. So I'm going to go ahead and remember to show you guys what the box looks like before I start digging into it. When I open it, it looks like this. All right. This is the fullest box that I have uh, opened so far. So this one's like full to the brim. It's a little bit heavier than my other boxes. The last two I got were Bath and Beauty related products and this one is health and nutrition so it's a little bit different and some of these items are bigger um i already know what all this stuff is pretty much pretty much because i checked the manifest like i'm so on top of the manifest my phone keeps falling this is terrible okay maybe it's propped good now i don't know that's the dangers of um propping your cell phone onto your bed on three boxes <sighs> we're real fancy around here Okay, these boxes have got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine mini massagers in them. And I believe they are in a variety of colors. I'm curious to see if I can just sell a whole box like this, all new, if it would sell faster that way, because I know I'm not making a bunch of money off of these mini massagers. Holy cow, I'm gonna turn this box. Otherwise, I'm gonna knock my phone off a third time. Okay. Here's the other box. I'm gonna make sure that they're all in here. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Okay. One has fallen out of this box. So I'm sure it's in there somewhere. I'm not really sure. I'm just saying that. Thinking positive, guys. On that note, if something is missing that wasn't the manifest, they will pay you back for it. All you have to do is send them a message and let them know and give them their numbers and information. Okay, yeah. Pink, red, pink, red. I think all of these are pink and red, actually. Oh, good. Okay. Um, there is, oh, an exercise mat. That's like a yoga mat. On the manifest, it said tumbling mat. And I wasn't really sure what that would entail because there was not a picture included. But this can be used for... 
I would imagine yoga, and my daughter is really getting into yoga lately. I don't know. It says, features slip-resistant surface, durable, lightweight, and easy to roll up for storage and travel, and great for any floor exercise. So, there you go. And, like I said, this is uninspected returns, so we will see what happens. Um, my thought on getting unexpected returns again, even though I said I never, I never would do that again, um, the Bath & Beauty products can explode and open, and I don't know, I thought, well... Maybe, just maybe, items that aren't Bath & Beauty, you can have a different experience because some of the videos that I watch, people have really good experiences with um, uninspected returns. Penny liners. There are penny liners and tampons in this box. And again, I've told you guys before, I always buy a box that I know have items in it that um, I can use, my family can use. Which is why I was kind of attracted to the Bath & Beauty products to begin with because if something doesn't sell, hello, I can use it. There are supposed to be three of these in here. They are Sound Spa, um, portable sound machines by Home Medics. So I see one, I see two, and these look like they are all sealed and new. That is awesome. There's like not even any damage. You can see they're still, you know, like brand spanking you. That's awesome. And they're pretty lightweight, so they won't cost that much to ship, but I can probably even sell those locally. Here's something cute. What are these? Milk chocolate hearts. It says milk chocolate hearts. I do not see milk chocolate hearts. What I do see is two kitty cats hugging each other. That's adorable. I love that. Okay. Um, this is bigger. This is a scale by Taylor and um, it analyzes your body composition and tells you how fat you are. I will not be using that. I will be selling that. So I've already got a scale and I already know how fat I am. So now actually, here's the interesting things. Interesting thing about stuff like this. People don't like to shop for stuff like this. I don't know, they, they will buy this online. I looked and um, I'll be selling these like in two seconds for sure. Okay, here is a really cool coffee cup. Ooh, part of me wants to keep it. I'm not going to. It's Starbucks. Anything with a Starbucks label on it will sell. And it's pretty heavy too. That's sweet. There's that. There is somewhere in here a container. I'm looking to see if this is it. Yes, okay, this is it. La Roche Posse. I don't know. Is that the right way to say that? It um, has a tag on here that says it is um, $44.99. And I looked it up, and it's literally selling for like that online. So there you go. That's half of what I paid for this box. <laughs> what else do we have in here? Serenity Spa Oasis. Um, it's a little LED oil diffuser. Those always sell really well. This is so little and cute. All the ones I've ever had were way bigger than that. It says that there is seven soothing colors to suit every mood. Oh, here's the little guy that fell out. Oh, batteries included. Okay. What else do we have in here? Oh, <laughs> Summer's Eve coconut water. I'll toss those over there. Okay, pineapple and macaya berry and coconut natural, all natural lip balm. Another thing I have found is if you can find a box with all natural products, a lot of stores don't keep those. A lot of people look for those online. Um, Flonase. It's a Flonase. Uh, now, okay, this comes in a bag, but it looks like the actual container isn't messed up. I'm curious. I'm spending entirely too much time messing with this. Um, okay, so the package was unsealed. I'll have to open it up and see if there's an additional seal if it's been messed with, but um, my kids have allergies, and I have allergies, and we actually use Flonase. 
That was another one of those things where I was like, hey, sealed or unsealed, that's money I don't have to spend. This was not on the manifest, to my knowledge, or it was listed as something that didn't tell me exactly what it was, because now I'm thinking, and there were two things, that this could be gliding exercise discs. In the package, box got a little rip on it. You look like an idiot when you try to use these, but hey, you do you. Oh, okay. So this was something else that was on the manifest that drew me to this manifest. Again, like I was telling you, I will look for items that will cover the cost of the box, and then the rest is just either keep or play, whatever, like, you can sell it or not and still walk away with what you put into it. These are called No Jet Lag Homeopathic Jet Lag Prevention um, Tablets. Let me double check. Oh, it doesn't say on this. This is what they look like. I can make $10 off of each one of these. One, two, three, four, five. Fifty dollars. Okay, so between these and um, that one container of, like, eye moisturizing, anti-wrinkle, whatever, like, this is the whole price that I paid for the box. These are the items that I was banking on selling that sell quickly and sell for like a decent amount of money. So the rest of this is stuff I can use or stuff I can make money selling. Um, this is Flonase for children, but it is like the Target brand. Again, like it looks 100% sealed, so try to sell it. If I don't sell it, my kids will use it, whatever. Okay. This is essential oils. Um, it is a blend made for sleep, encouraging sleep, naturally tranquil. It's a roll-on little thingamajig here. I love essential oils. Love it. Again, the all-natural stuff, people eat it up. Oh, I'm not going to sell these. These are just like carrot seeds. It says it's a kaleidoscope blend. I will grow these and um, we will eat them. Alright, this is a three-pack resistance loop band kit. Okay, so I'm going to guess the two items that didn't say exactly what they were. They just had like a color. Like one of them was like Vivitar Aqua and one was like Vivitar or something else. And I looked... Okay. Yeah, this is that. Okay, so it's a loop band kit. Exercising deal. You know what? I wonder if I could sell this and those sliding, gliding carpet things together as a set. I don't know. I can't reach the other side of this box. I'll shake that down. Okay. Doc McStuffins Pet Rescue. Some sort of a blind bag. This, I remember, was listed like sells for $10. My kids are not into Doc McStuffins, so I'll sell that. Okay, I remember seeing this. I don't think that these are selling well at all. I looked on multiple um, different and multiple different uh, platforms and it doesn't look like these sell at all. This was something I was like, well, whatever. It's cocktail syrup set, so you can use it and then you mix your own alcohol with it and you can make an old fashioned, a tonic, and a hot toddy. If you need one of these to make a drink, I mean, come on. I, this is really kind of like a gift, like you'd give this to somebody, I guess, I don't know, I wouldn't use that, I don't guess many people are using it, which is why they aren't selling well, there's only a few things left in this box, I'm actually going to get to the bottom of this one, the other ones like had so many little tiny things, I showed you guys like most, or half of the stuff, and then, you know, anyways, Aquaphor Lotion, it's a healing ointment, this sells quick, I'm not worried, that's going to go quick, um, and there's two things left, in this box. A skin brightening papaya peel off mask. Um, I've tried to sell like masks and stuff like this before but I haven't noticed that I don't think this would be worth investing your money in at all. I mean I don't even think I would if they were like a ton in the like boxes or whatever. Um, me and my girls use these so. One mask that may be worth like three dollars and this chapstick total hydration um, it's tinted lip oil in the color Sheer Plum. 
Alright, so that is everything in this box. Thanks for hanging out with me and looking through all of it today. I know it was a little bit different than um, the last two boxes that I've done, and I will let you guys know how long it takes me to make my money back on this. Um, the first box that I bought, it took me almost two weeks, or maybe it was like two weeks exactly to sell enough to make my money back on, and then um, the second box, it only took me like a week or a week and a half. It was really close to that, so um, I'm not worried about this one at all. And like I said, there is a... Uh, six items that I can sell and make all of my money back on this box and the rest is all profit. Um, I'm kind of doing this in small batches just just because um, I'm not ready to take a big gamble on like a palette. I probably never will be to be honest with you. I just, you know, I just don't want to spend that much money on shipping. Ugh. Unless it was a really good deal. Look at me. I'm actually considering it. I'm like, but yeah, so what I'll do is I'll check back in with you guys after um, I make my money back on this box. Maybe it'll only be a couple of days. Maybe I'll get lucky. Who knows? But until the next time, thank you for joining me. And um, let me know if you're doing bulk.com or if you have any questions about how I've been able to be successful with this so far. Um, don't just get on there and buy whatever. Don't, don't, don't. I've seen multiple videos of people that it honestly looks like they didn't even try. Like they just went on there and they said... Um, I've got $400, and that one's worth $400. Don't do it. Just don't do it. I go through all the manifests, even the ones, some of the ones I know I'm not going to buy, just to get an idea of what is in different types of um, cases and all that jazz. So I think if you're smart and if you research what's selling, how fast it's selling, and you maybe buy a case that if some of the stuff in it doesn't sell, you can still use, that's still money in your pocket, in my opinion, because you're getting it for, like, what did I say? Everything in this box I paid one eighty four for. So um, if I need a gift at a party, I'll be the cool one that shows up with the uh, cocktail syrup set and make everybody's day. And if I don't, a dollar and eighty four cents. You know, I didn't waste my time or my money. So, anyways, maybe I'll try one. Maybe I'll see what's up with this. You know what? The hot toddy one. Okay. The hot toddy one, if I was um, sick or whatever, I could see doing that. Tonic? Citrus? No. I don't know, guys. I don't know about this. Yeah, anyways. I'm just going to start rambling now. So you guys have a good rest of the day. And I will see you next time. Bye.